Hi, my name is Peter Lamb. I'm a lecturer at the School of Physical Education, Sport and Exercise Sciences. I teach performance analysis and sports biomechanics, and I'm the program leader of sports technology. Sports technology is a rapidly changing discipline. It basically involves measuring and analyzing human performance. Uh, a few careers that students go into after taking sports technology are performance analysis, where you'd be looking at analyzing uh, game stats, either from video or from specialized sensors. Uh, technique analysis, which is a study of individual skills using mainly biomechanical analysis. Uh, students often go into research and development, so they would do product testing, um, looking at things like shoe technology or different sports equipment. Uh, some students uh, go into research. We had a student uh, last year who just finished up. He was working with Snow Sport New Zealand, um, studying the workload and performance of uh, elite snowboard athletes in slope style snowboarding. Uh, if you decide to enroll in sports technology, your first year would involve studying a core group of papers looking at human physiology, anatomy, and sports science. Later on in the program, you, could, you have a choice of choosing between uh, a couple different pathways. So one pathway would be design, which would be most, would, which would consist mostly of computer science papers. And another pathway is analysis, where you would be taking statistics and data analysis, data science papers. It'll be helpful if you have a strong mathematics and science background from year 13 in school. If you decide to come to Otago to study sports technology, we have an excellent staff. We look forward to working with you and teaching you about exercise physiology, biomechanics, and motor control. We're the top ranked university in New Zealand for sports related topics, and we're currently ranked 12th in the world. If you're interested in sports technology, we look forward to hearing from you.